Hello and welcome. Thanks for joining us. A great night for baseball ahead on the show. It's the Seattle Mariners going up against the Oakland Athletics. And we'll be back with the first pitch right after this. Ready to go? Getting the nod in this one. Sean Manaya. what do we need to know here? Well, the hammer is in effect, and he sets it up so nicely because of the velocity on the fastball. Will elevate that and then break you off when he's ahead in the count. What I love about him, you get into the later innings of the ball game, and the velocity seems to go up. The flip to the pitcher covering. Frazier retired. And here is Ty France. Good contact guy, good defender. pitch got him looking and there's two down two outs space is empty here's Jesse Winker he's someone that really beats up on right-handed pitching the lefties however give him a little bit more trouble the punch out there and good work there as he gets a one two three of the first and on the mound now Robbie Ray anytime you have five pitches to work with on the mound that repertoire can be a real weapon in terms of keeping hitters off balance man it's it's one of those things that I'm gonna be oh this one high and deep way back there up against the wall and makes the catch here's Elvis Andrews and now the lefty in the air out to center, Rodriguez settles under this one, and there's two away. So here's Murphy now. 1-1 one, one now. And that one fouled off. There's a swing and a drive. That's going back. Back some more. Pulls it in on the warning track. And one, two, three go the A's. Scoreless after one. And welcome back. Now batting Mitch Hanniger. Got him. And there's one down. Eugenio Suarez up to the plate now. That is the third base. Next offering is in for a strike. Second inning here, no score. Next pitch is outside. Really good take, especially with two strikes. Eric Summers Gill with home plate duty in this one. Kind of known for being generous with the corners, Chris. You know, I think that used to be a lot bigger deal in past eras where pitchers were working more in and out with their pitches. But, yeah, we'll see if those corners come into play in this one. Hey, no pitcher's going to argue at all. And it gets by him. He kind of rolled over on this pitch a little bit, but he got enough behind it to shoot it through for a knock. And you'll take that anytime you can get him to find a hole. On the ground right side, four, six, three, but he beats it. Good hustle, and the inning continues. Here's the center fielder, Julio Rodriguez. The next pitch misses, and it's two and one. Backdoor breaking ball just missed right there, and boy, umpire didn't give him the call. I bet you if he throws it again, hitter knows he's going to have to swing it. Over to first, and he's saved. Crawford off of first with two away. There's a high chopper. Throw on to Brown. And that is that. One left for Seattle. We'll go to the bottom of the second. No score. Bottom of the inning, and now Seth Brown. Yeah, 
check swing, but it's put in play. Frazier on the first in time. And a quick out number one. Nice job of deception right there by the pitcher. Got the hitter out there a little bit. Couldn't check his swing and induces a nice little ground out. Now a high fly ball out to left center. Rodriguez going back on this one. Makes the grab on the run. Two up, two down. Every day during batting practice, these outfielders get about 10 minutes of balls in the gaps. They practice this, and when the game comes, they make the play perfectly. Lined, and that's a base hit. And that's going to get into the corner. The throw into second, and he's out. Cut down, and that ends the inning. We'll move to the third with no score. Back in Oakland, yeah, the batter now, Jared Kellner. Well, on paper, it's favorable to have a fairly quick inning here with two of the three hitters he's set to face batting from the left side, same side he throws from. It's through for a hit. Off to a good start with a leadoff nod. Love how he let that ball travel, trusted his hands. Nice job of going the other way. Now it's Tom Murphy. The pitch. Breaking ball in there for a strike. Top of the third, no score. Maybe a two ball, five, four, three. And they turn the double play. Here's Adam Frazier. 0 for 1. He grounded out to first his last time. And down on strikes he goes. Third out. Home half of the third coming up. No score. As we go to the last of the third. Digging in. Chad Pinder. Kicks and deals. And he swings and lifts one to deep center field. That one back there. And it's off the batter's eye. So he just clears the wall, and they jump out front. It's 1-0. That one was a hanger, and pitchers typically don't get away with making a mistake like that. And right there, he made him pay. Kevin Smith up next for the A's. The pitch. Up the middle, and it's through for a hit. Back-to-back -back base hits. Couldn't get any air under it, but he smoked that ball back up the middle. Timing was just perfect. Got great wood on it, and there's just no chance for the infielders with how hard he hit it. In the air, right field. Pretty well struck, and that ball is gone. They're going crazy in the dugout, and they add on. It's 3-0. That's the exact definition of hitting the ball where it's pitched, taking that outside fastball, and driving it the opposite way out of the ballpark. You want to bottle that type of approach. Here's Tony Kemp. In the air, left field. Puts it away for the out. Up next for Oakland. Elvis Andrews, up next for the A's. 0 for 1 so far. The 1-1. One, one. On the ground. Fires over to first. That's it out. So two down now. And here is Sean Murphy. Glide out his first time. The pitch. Out towards right center field. Rodriguez makes the catch, and that'll do it. But the long ball was working in. Welcome back. John Chomby with Chris Singleton, and set to lead off the fourth, Ty France. And here it comes. Foul ball. He caught it behind his back. Got him. Great play to keep the leadoff man off base. Up next to Seattle, the designated hitter, Jesse Winker. And stepping in for the Mariners, Jesse Winker. 
Right. Next offering is in for a strike. Well, I think that pitch surprised all of us. Right down the middle, doesn't get a swing. Not very often you see a hitter lay off a cookie like that. Got him. That's out number two. Two outs, space is empty. And up next for Seattle, Mitch Hanniger. Next offering is downstairs. Here's an opportunity to do some damage and perhaps unlock this offense. 3 1 count. Be ready to turn on a fastball. Now, front pulls that one foul. Now it's 3 and 2. The wind and the pitch stays alive. Good battle here, about to be the eighth pitch of the at-bat. Next offering is fouled back. Here comes a pitch. Swing and a foul ball at the plate. They'll do it again. And he deals. Swing and a tapper. The throw to first. And they take care of Hanniger for the out. And that'll do it. Back here in the East Bay. Ready to go. Bottom four. And now the first baseman, Seth Brown. Foul ball there. Up the middle. Crawford throws the first in time. One up, one down. And here is Jed Lowry. The switch hitter batting right. One down, base is empty. And that one hammered. That's back there. Turning, looking, and that one is gone. He blasts one out to center, and they add to the lead. It's 4-0. The pitcher knew as soon as that ball left his fingertips, it was trouble. Right on a platter, right down the heart of the plate. I'm sorry, but big league hitters don't miss that pitch. Here's Steven Piscotti. Popped up right side. Frazier under it. Hauls it in for the out. And now... Chad Pinder. Pinder. Swing and a ball hammered left field. That's back. And that is gone. It just got out of here. He's done it again. His second homer of the game. It's five zip. Next to hit, Kevin Smith. And that one is lifted in the air. Can't get there. And now maybe extra bases. And it kicks off the base of the wall. And that's a two-out double. Wasting no time. He's two for two now on the night. And just a triple and home run away from the cycle. Seriously, we're starting with this already. Justice Sheffield comes on now. He comes in with his team trailing by a bunch. So he'll try to keep it where it is. This one swung on and hit well. Way back there. On the warning track. And hauls it in. But the long ball was working in this. Back here at the ballpark. Here's the third baseman. A. Eugenio Suarez. Next offering misses. Three and one. He hasn't fallen behind in the count like this all day. He's in danger of walking his first batter right here. Three and two now. Rolled softly, but that goes foul. The wind of the pitch. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. One away here in the fifth. Really love the pitch sequence right there. I'm telling you what, pitcher and catcher on the same page right now. Left-hand batter waits. And a swing and a miss there. Kicks and fires. And down on strikes. Two away down. And now for Seattle, Julio Rodriguez. 
He's 0 for 1. And that chance handled. And that is that. Nobody left for Seattle. It's five. And welcome back. Now, here is Tony Kemp. And he hits a ground ball right side. Sneaks through. Base hit. So a runner aboard to start the inning. There was nothing cheap about the way he got that one through the infield. That was ripped. Caught out in front and didn't get under it like he would have liked, but definitely put a good swing on it. And a pitch. That's ripped. Base hit. And now runners at the corners. Nobody out. Two consecutive base hits for these guys here. I could watch base hits like that one all day long, and so could every hitting coach in the league. Just a nice line drive into center field. Check swing, but he went too far. Going to count one and two. And a pitch. In the air to left center. Kelman going back. Back some more. Grabs it on the run. And that should get the job done as he tags from third. He's in to score on the sack fly. It's 6-0. So here's Brown at the plate. Andrews leads off first with one away. Smoked on the ground a second to Crawford for one. Double play. What a twin killing to end the inning. Welcome back. Here's Jared Kelnick. The 2 1. Bounce to the right side oh, and foul ball. And now two and two. And he grounds one back up the middle. Andrews throws the first. And that's one out as they get the leadoff hitter in the sixth. That was an impressive diving stop. Singy, let's dive into the numbers. Statcast the symbol. Yeah, Boog, a really good effort just to get his glove to the ball. He found a way to do it and just produce a strong throw as well. So that right there is a great play all the way around. Just really smooth. Out to short and a base hit. So the one out hit turns the lineup over. Really nice job of two strike hitting in that at bat. Got the top of the ball a little bit, but not much. That was hit pretty hard through the infield, so I think he'll be happy with that swing. Definitely generated some good bat speed. Smith to second, that's one. Over to first, safe. Well, he's doing a nice job of keeping the ball out of the air. Let's the defense work behind him with another ground ball. Good execution. Now the number two hitter, Ty France. Swing and a line drive, base hit out of the center field. They stopped the lead runner at second. Now two on with two outs. All over that one right there. Everything was on time and flew. Jesse. Manager out of the dugout, and he's going to make a change. Pitching change here, Sam Mole. And he's got a nice lead to work with. And now Jesse Winker. Fouled off again, and it remains three and two. To kick the 3 2. Tapped out in front of the plate. To first, and he beats it. Everyone's safe. And now the right fielder, Mitch Hanniger. In for a strike. Now it's 3 and 2. Frazier, the runner at third. France on second. Winker on the first with two down. Got him. The error becomes a moot point. Inning over. And the Mar Back here in the East Bay. Bottom of the sixth inning. And now the DH, Jed Lowry. The wine of the pitch. 
into center. Rodriguez makes the catch, and there's one down. Now batting. Stepping in, Steven Piscotti. One for two. The 1-1. One, one. Lifted in the air, right center field. Rodriguez on the move. Snags it on the run. And there are two outs. Well, those can be pretty fun as an outfielder. Got to put it into his highest gear and go a long way to track that one down. Nothing better than that. You feel like a wide receiver playing football. Lined into right. Base hit. And that extends the inning. Man, those are the types of hits where you don't feel any vibration in your hands whatsoever. Such a good feeling. Anytime you rip a line drive the other way, you feel really good about what you did at the plate. You well struck left field. And that one is off the wall. Crawford with a relay home. And he's out. Cut down and that ends the inning. The A's strand one. But they're on top by a count of six to nothing. All set for the start of the inning. A Eugenio Suarez up to hit down. He is very much your typical power hitter. I'd say he falls into the three true outcomes category. But we've seen more and more of that lately. The ability to drive, and that squirts through. Now he'll turn for second. In safely. It's a double, and his second hit. Just a simple ground ball the other way. They had eyes on it, man. Sometimes that's all you need to do. Just let the ball travel, put the ball in play, and just hope it finds a hole. And yeah, the batter now, J.P. Crawford. Payoff pitch. Fought off foul. At the belt and fires. Bounce to the right. Kemp collects it. Sends it to first. That's the first out in the top of the seventh. Deceptive slider right there. Stayed in the tunnel a long time. Got that hitter out front. Rolled over it. Put it on the ground. And now the center fielder, Julio Rodriguez. Swing and a miss. And the count is one and two. And now the lefty. Swing and a pop-up. Foul territory for the catcher. Murphy makes the play. Two away. So up next, Jared Kellner. And a pitch. Got him looking. And that's the third out. Mariners lead one. They still find themselves down. Six zip. Back in Oakland, here's Christian Pache. Check swing, but he went too far. And it's one and two. He swings and hits a fly ball. Center field. Rodriguez settles underneath it, calls it in, and there's one away. So the batting order turns over. Now it's the second baseman, Tony Kemp, for the fourth time tonight. And down on strikes he goes, and there's two down. Two outs, base is empty. Elvis Andrews up next for the A's. Not shortstop. Elvis. Smash to the left side. On to France, and that is the inning. This guy's anticipation is off the charts. Don't see many shortstops better than that. Great job to complete the play and end the inning. Back here at the ballpark, ready to begin the eighth. Now the Mariners catcher, Tom Murphy. Here's a 1-1. And it's fouled away. That's the third. Throw on to Brown. And that's one away as the leadoff man is out in the eighth. Now batting. The Here's the second baseman, Adam Frazier. The pitch. Hauls it in, and there's two away. Two outs, base is empty. And stepping in for the Mariners, Ty France. One for three. 
Right through there, got him. That's the third out. Mariners are down in order. Still up against a six-nothing deficit. And welcome back. Here's Sean Murphy. The wide to kick the pitch. Oh, now this is blasted. Way back there. On its way. Gone. John Murphy circles the bases. And they boost their lead. It's 7-0. Next to hit, Seth Brown. Liner, and that should be extra bases. Around first and hustling for second. And he'll pull in there with a stand-up double. So, man aboard. Here's Lowry now. The pitch. Swing, and that ball smashed on a line. Makes the catch. Runner tags it second, and he makes it up to third with one away. Digging in for Oakland, Steven Piscotti. 2-2 now. This one smacked out to left center. Can't get their base hit. And now it rolls all the way to the wall. In comes the run from third. And it's an eight-run lead. And in its second with an RBI double. A little more backspin on that instead of the top spin. And he's jogging around the bases rather than pulling up at second. New pitcher for the Mariners, Sergio Romo. Big deficit here, but he's still got a job to do. Chad Pinder now. Got him. Two out. Now the third baseman, Kevin Smith. Third baseman, number one, Kevin Smith. Ripped on a line. Makes a nice running catch. And that is that. Full. It's the A's eight and the Mariners nothing. New inning getting started. Now it's the Mariners DH. Jesse Winker. One ball, two strikes. Swang and a high fly ball in the air left field. That ball's carrying. Pulls it in on the warning track. Mitch Hanniger up next for the Mariners. That one is absolutely belted back there. Can't get there. Base hit. And into second with one away. That's a double good job of just putting the ball in play with two strikes a lot of times in today's game right fielders are able to get to a ball that stays in like that but he hit that one pretty well and if he hits it just a little bit different on the barrel it's out of here easily but there's nothing wrong with the extra bases right there JP Crawford gets a chance to hit the one one and he grounds one to the right side. Ken over to pick it up. Roll to first and ball game. And the A's take this one in a blowout. What a big win by eight runs. And when you have that kind of lead, you make it easier for the pitching staff to come out, make their pitches, pitch to contact, and not worry 